Hello everybody, thank you for tuning in to this graphics practice video. Now in the past I created one of these videos just sort of an optional activity that you can do at home. Now I'm going to do this again but I'm going to focus specifically on what the choice board is asking you to do for this week. So just like in my last video, I talked about how when we do graphics practice you need a piece of paper or maybe a dry erase board, just something to write on. You're also going to need something to write with. In this case, I have a dry erase marker. Now, before we do any sort of graphics practice, in the classroom, we always like to start by doing a little bit of a story to get us engaged and in the mood for writing. So my story today is going to be for X marks the spot because that's the activity that's on our choice board for next week. So we're going to pretend like we're pirates. Right, pretend you have a pirate hat on and we're, we're steering the pirate ship and we're looking for buried treasure. So pretend that you have your treasure map. You can pretend this paper is your treasure map and you're looking for where the buried treasure is. You're looking for X marks the spot, right? So you need to draw where X marks the spot and the way we're gonna do this is by going slant right, slant left. Slant right, slant left, slant right, slant left. You could practice in the air with your marker first, right? Slant right, slant left, slant right, slant left. Now, when we do graphics practice, you need to play music as you do it. And you know that when you hear the music, you can do slant right, slant left. And remember to use your voice and tell your hand what to do. If you tell your hand what to do, you're going to make some perfect X's, right? But when the music stops, remember you don't write when the music stops. You need to freeze and hold your marker up. Now, parents, families, you can choose to play some other music and do this on your own. Or you can pause this video and do it along with me today. Now, everybody's at a different level. So when we do this, some of us might really just be working on our slants, right? Slant right, slant left, slant right, slant left. Some of us are ready for a challenge. If you're ready for this challenge, this is what I'm gonna ask you to do if you think you're ready for it. I'm gonna ask you to make a pattern with your X's. You can do big slant right, big slant left, tiny slant right, tiny slant left. Big slant right, big slant left, tiny slant right, tiny slant left. You get where I'm going with that? So if you're ready for the challenge, you can do it in a pattern. If you're not quite ready, do it at your own pace and that's okay. Now, I think we're ready to go. So now is the point where you can pause the video and get the materials you need or you can go ahead and watch what I'm doing and do it on your own after the video. You get to choose. Okay, well, I'm gonna get my music going and remember to use your private speech to tell your hands what to do. Slant right, slant left. Slant right, slant left. Slant right, slant left. Do it one more time. Slant right, slant left, 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 slant right, slant left. Okay. And there we go. We filled up an entire dry erase board of X's for X marks the spot. Now, remember. After you're done doing this at your homes, if you choose to do this for the choice board, take a picture and send it to me so I know the amazing work that you're doing at home. Feel free to reach out if you have any questions. You know I'm always here to help. 
and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Have fun!